When you see something like this problem, you want to be very organized. But you also want to be able to see, okay, maybe I can find, before I start doing a lot of multiplying, maybe I can find something that will be easy to use. Uh, before I get started, I need to put this three exponent throughout all. So, I can say it's five squared, two to the third power, four squared makes four to the six because it's squared, 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 six, times three cubed times five. Now, wait a minute. Hey, this five can join him. So he becomes a three. Look at all of these two times five. That's tens. Ten, ten, ten. So I'm going to call this. Can we call it ten squared? Yeah. Ten double zeros. Plus, then we just have to multiply this out, which is uh, twenty-seven there. And then, oh my goodness, how many do we have here? We've got 4 to 4 to 4. So it's like 16 times 16 times 16 times 27. So you multiply those out. But that is the fun part, finding that, those extra zeros. I hope you like that one.